see if I have the same rights as a driver, then why can I not drive across here since I'm also a vehicle or a transportation too? A moving transportation, I'm considered as a driver, and he is considered as a driver too. And he has the right to run me over without apologizing to me. And it makes it more inconvenient for me to go straight down to the next light, turn left, and then come left again, straight down this way, just to cross the street. And they should have a crosswalk like that drawn over here so people can cross back and forth for their, their convenience. It's not fair for me that he ran over me. He ran over my bike and his front, his side of the tire um, on the driver's side has ran over. I'll show you. His tire ran over right here on half of my half of my uh, tire. That's his front tire, which is the left tire ran over, crushing my bike. And this is a brand new bike. He ran over this tire, and lucky, luckily I took my feet up, or else he ran over my leg. And he still don't even apologize and thinking he's uh, he's right. He's wrong for running me over. That's assault with a deadly weapon. His car is a deadly weapon. And put the police that day, let him get onto my bike, and each person, let them get onto my bike if they disagree with me that thinking I'm at fault, where it's him at fault, and each uh, police, like the police and each person, get on my bike, cross the street right over here, and let him run, let that uh, gr uh, white guy, that's a driver of the um, gray Kia, let him run each person over and see how it feels. How would you feel if he ran you over and you on my bike? And it's very inconvenient for me to go from here to down there to cross over and then to go back this way and then to go over there you know it's very inconvenient they should draw a crosswalk for people bicycling people to cross over and so uh, the pedestrian can cross over too they should have a light right here 